friends, welcome back. So today I'm bringing you guys another video and this is finally gonna be another lip swatch video. I used to do these every single month but I kind of just ran out of lip products to do lip swatches of. I mean I have maybe like one or two more brands that I can do for liquid lipsticks besides this video but other than that I really don't have that much love. But today's video is gonna be all about the ColourPop Ultra, I should probably have grabbed them before this, Ultra Metallic Lips. I do have a video swatching the Ultra Matte Lips and the Ultra Satin Lips. Both those videos will be linked down below as well as all of the other lip swatch videos that I've done in the past. I've done maybe like 10 at this point. This will probably be like number 11. But I wanted to do a video on these because I mean like I said I already have for the satin and the matte so it would only be fair. Originally they released four shades then came out with four lighter shades and then now they just released three more shades for the fall so I'm really excited to do this video for you guys. Metallic lips are kind of really on trend right now everybody's kind of putting them out I think Ofra just came out with duo chrome and trio chrome <laughs> liquid lipsticks which I think is really cool I love doing weird things you guys know this anything that's kind of just like outside of the box I'm like yes bring me more so like always I will leave a time right here for when the video where the actual swatches start so if you want to just go ahead and skip to that time please feel free to do so. So the formula of these liquid lipsticks kind of reminds me a lot of the Ultra Satin Lips by ColourPop. If you guys have ever tried those, you know those are kind of a different formula because they're not matte, they don't dry down to a matte finish, they're not transfer proof. These, in my opinion, are more transfer proof than the Ultra Satin Lips. I feel like the Ultra Satin Lips kind of transfer a lot. These, I mean, barely, I don't think there's even anything on my hand. I've heard kind of mixed reviews about these. I've heard a lot of people say that they're not as pigmented as they would have hoped that they would be. And I mean, they're metallic liquid lipsticks, like they're not supposed to be pigmented. They're supposed to be just like very metallic and kind of like a sheen on your lips. There's almost no way that you're going to get full opacity on one swipe with a metallic liquid lipstick unless like there's some magical stuff going on in there. And for them being metallic liquid lipsticks, I actually do feel like they are pretty pigmented. So that's just my personal opinion. I feel like they're pretty good. The color that I'm wearing right now is salt and I feel like it would it goes good with like a bronzy eye. So I just thought I'd wear it. For the of course, like ColourPop always is, these are super affordable. I think they are $6 each, so even if you pick up all 11 shades, which I actually don't recommend doing, but I'll tell you why right now. Um, if you did, I mean, it'd only be $66, bucks, which is really not bad. Some liquid lipsticks go for like $20, so with $66, bucks, you would be getting three shades, you know what I mean? The reason that I don't suggest picking up all 11 shades, I would say maybe pick up like three or four, is first of all because this is a metallic trend. It's not something that's going to be around forever. It's not something that's like an ultra matte lip that you know that you can wear, you know, forever, that it's not going to go out of style because it's just like a regular lipstick. This is a metallic lipstick. It's kind of a really trendy thing, you know what I'm saying? I think that's all I have to say for this little mini review. I know you guys are probably all here for the lip swatches, so let's just jump into them. Which means I'm missing a color. So I'm missing the color JIC, which stands for just in case. And I'm gonna tell you guys if I messed up or color brown messed up. Damn, I ordered salt twice. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. I thought I ordered the right color. I'm sorry, I'm a mess. Don't, don't judge me. <laughs>
saying. I don't know what I'm saying. And I don't know what I'm saying. I don't know what I'm saying. Oh my god. What? I don't know what I'm saying. Oh, por que Dios. What? What? Siento ganas de llorar. Ponte me bien, ponte me bien. La, da, da. Lo siento por ti, pero no sea así. Dime quién eres tú. Mi cáncer de amor. Them vocals, though. So I'm sure you guys already know what the foundation that we're trying out today is the Anastasia Beverly Hills Stick Foundation. I bought mine in the color amber and I did find a picture on 